I had a bit of a mistake the last randomizer that I did, and what I'm going to do this game is fix it. What I did last game was, uh, the only thing that was randomized was the starter Pokemon, and that kind of defeats the purpose of having a randomizer Nuzlocke challenge. So I had to go ahead and remake a whole new randomizer, I actually had to mess with the settings. And after that, I finally got a randomizer game, so we're gonna go ahead and give it a go. I also realized that the Nuzlocke challenge applies once you get your Pokeballs. Alright, we already went through this whole part. Sorry to keep you waiting, welcome to the world Pokemon! Uh, probably I'm gonna go ahead and skip this to whenever I'm heading over to the next town, so let's go ahead and do that. Alright, but before I skip to the whole city part, let's go ahead and see what starters we can choose from. And also, I completely forgot as I've been talking to every single person in this game to change my options. To make the tech speed fast, and to change the battle style to set. Let's go ahead and give that confirm. Alright, let's see what Pokemon we get. Touch your Pokeball to see what Pokemon is inside. Get a Geodude. A Star Raptor. And a Tyranitar. Jesus Christ. This is just better Poopitar. We can have Poopy again! And don't worry, Toki, I will name one after you. The first one that I catch. I just wanted to keep Poopy with me alongside this journey. Mom, look at my Pokemon. It's so cute. It's not cute. Bulls. Uh, Pokemon. Impish Nature. New Bark Town, met at level 5. What's his, uh... Oh, ability. Rough skin. Inflicts damage to the foe on contact. Huh. And then bite, leer, sandstorm, screech. Uh... There's some pretty basic stats for a level 5, I think. We got this in the bag. Oh, God. Oh, God! Come on, Poopy, we got this! It's only a level 2 Tyranitar. Take that damage! <laughs> now this is a real randomizer. Heck you! Okay, so I, I got him. I got him down now. Nice. Am I gonna, oh, I thought I was gonna level up first. Go. Let's go. This time we're gonna grab that berry too. Oh Jesus! Okay. <laughs> This actually frightens me a bit, because anything can pop out of the bushes. Oh. Well, I think its evolution also has to affect how much XP I get, because when last time I was playing this, I never gained this much XP from just wild Pokemon. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, Apricorn Tree. Oh, so I was supposed to put something in it? Says there's not nothing to put it in. There's no reason to take it. Huh. I guess it's not like ripened or something. I, I wouldn't know. I guess we never missed anything. Oh, and here we got the whole old man thing. Let's go ahead and continue where we left off. So then, as the old man said, Mr. Pokemon's house is up here, so we're gonna go ahead and give him a visit. Oh, what's going on? I made it. I forgot about one thing. This is another token for me. Take it. The guide getting loaded the map card on Debra. Oh, okay. Nice. Okay. Yep, just heading down. Is it gonna be the, by the dark cave, or is it just gonna be down this path? I think it's just gonna be down this path, because he did say north of uh, Cherry Grove City. Let's go ahead and back out of that, and go. Oh, I'm, I'm not pressing the B button. Walk to try to avoid conflict. There you go. Perfect. Beautiful. 
then we're gonna go ahead and fight our first trainer. If he, if, is he up? Oh no! Noise will attract Pokemon or trainers. <laughs> okay. Oh, here's his house. This probably should be it. People usually come to my house looking for Mr. Pokemon's house. You did mean to visit my house. How kind of you. Do you have any apricorns? Apricorn trees bear fruit once a day. I have one of those trees too. Apricorns are really something. You can make Pokeballs and other things. They are quite useful. I have a feeling this is meant to be. I'm so happy that I'll give you this. Apricorn box! I, I, actually, I actually didn't mean to... Uh, Oh, that's the reason why I couldn't uh, pick it in, because I don't have a uh, apricorn box. Okay. So now I can collect them. That's cool. Uh, let's go ahead and head up here. Guess he's further down. Nice, we made it. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this potion. Antidote. Okay. I really want to fight a Pokemon trainer, that way I can see what they get, because I know that it's going to be random. This guy over here? What's going on over here? Oh, they're having a Pokemon battle. Oh, I'm talking to him. Poopy looks like it wants to lead. Then go in front of me then. Oh. Okay. Head left here? How come we haven't had any interactions yet? I'm surprised. You know, for a second, I thought I was going to jinx it by saying that, but... <laughs> wow. <laughs> We're just fly... Okay, so here's this house. We're just flying by through these bushes. There he is, and look, it's Professor Oak! It was I who sent an email to Professor Elm earlier. What research you have for us this time, Mr. Pokemon? This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. In the mystery egg. Can't put it in my key items. A friend of mine from Ekrutik. Ekrutik. <laughs> I bet you can't find this egg, kind of egg in Jodo. I thought Professor Elm might be able to tell us what this is. He's the best when it comes to the research of Pokemon evolution. There's a quote from the famous Professor Oak. You're returning to Professor Elm? Here, your Pokemon should have some rest. I, my Pokemon aren't even injured. Oh boy. Oh boy, look at him! It's Professor Oak! And with that, <laughs> I'm Professor Oak, a Pokemon research. I admit, when you left, I had my doubts that you could handle your Pikachu. <laughs> so you're there, Poo. I was just visiting my friend Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Oak, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon, I see. You must be helping Professor Elm's research. I think I understand why Professor Elm gave you that Pokemon. You will treat your Pokemon with love and care, it seems. Ah! You seem to be dependable. How could... How would you like me to help out? Or how would you like to help me out? Oh, I can't speak for shit. See, this is the latest version of the Pokedex. It automatically records data on the Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. I'd like you to have it. All right. Wait, why didn't I didn't get it from Professor Elm? Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Derpu, I have a feeling that this is not the last time we'll meet. Let's exchange numbers just to be on the safe side. All right. Got the professor's number. Still do not have our Pokeballs yet. Oh. Phone call from Professor Elm. Hello, Derpu. It's a disaster. Uh, it's just terrible. What should I do? It. Oh no. Please get back here now. Oh, it's probably that red-haired guy. Edgy boy. Let's go ahead and pick up our apricorn and then head over there. All right. Oh! Oh, okay, there you go. Okay. I thought we were gonna make it unscathed, but we not. I almost forgot what Pokemon that was for a second, but that's the one that evolved into Flygon, if I'm correct. Where did 
I think we we got a really good Pokemon for the start. Almost feels like I'm kind of cheating, really. <laughs> Yep, there you go, red-haired edgy boy! You got a Pokemon at the lab? What a waste. That's a Pokemon that's too good for a wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Oh. Okay, so I sh uh, <laughs> You just have one, you freaking loser. I don't recall that's the one that he usually has. But, uh, anyway, let's go ahead and take care of it. Uh oh. We'll be fine. Poopy got this. You're doing okay for someone so weak. Ah. Oh. Okay, it didn't do that much damage. Oh. <laughs> if anything, my rough skin's going to hurt him. There you go. Nice! Huh, are you happy you won? I mean, I, I really didn't care, you just kinda ran up to me and wanted a Pokemon battle. Do you wanna know who I am? Edgy Red Boy. You're gonna be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Okay, what do you think? Give it back, that's my trainer card. I know you saw my name. I didn't see your name. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Okay. Well, I'm gonna have to give my Pokemon some heals because you kind of damaged it a bit. Well, I kind of damaged it a bit because it <laughs> hurt itself in its confusion. Going through here. What's going on? Oh, okay, so he stole one of the Pokeballs. If you notice over there, rule number one, whoever did it will come back to the site. Oh my, so you must be the one who did it? What? Hold on a second, he has nothing to do with it. I saw it, there was a red-haired boy looking into the building. What? You battled a boy like that? He must be the one who did it. Did you happen to get his name? Oh, that's because I get to choose his name. Uh... Am I really gonna be generic like that? <laughs> no. I think that's a perfect name that probably defines who he best is, so we're gonna go ahead and stick with that. I see, so Bitch Boy was his name. Yes. Thanks for helping my investigation. My next assignment is to search for this red haired individual. Alright. Derpu, I'm glad they understand you are innocent. See you later. Sayonara! Derpu, this is terrible. Oh, yes. What was Mr. Pokemon's mis big discovery? <laughs> Derpu handed the mystery egg to Professor Elm. That's just a Togepi egg, huh? This is an egg, isn't it? This egg may be something I've never seen. Still, it's just an egg. Mr. Pokemon is always fascinated by eggs. Well, since he gave it to us, we might as well find out what secret it holds. I'll keep it for a while to find out about the egg. What? Professor Oak gave you a Pokédex? Derpu, is, is that true? That's incredible! He is superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Wow, Derpu. I knew you were a little different. Things are going to be fun. Your Pokémon seem to really like you, so why don't you take the Pokémon Gym Challenge? If you manage to defeat all the gym leaders, you eventually challenge the Pokémon League Champion. Or not. Haha. <laughs> Becoming the champion is not at all easy, but you can certainly challenge Violet to these gym. Derpu, challenging the gym scattered around will be a, a long journey. Before you leave, make sure you talk to your mom. Ma, I'm gonna go f fight some gym Pokemon, and I'm gonna be Pokemon Master. Alright, we- do we even still have no Pokeballs? Like, 
I really want to start catching Pokemon and start this Nuzlocke challenge. Does she hand me Pokeballs or are we battling? Battling. There you go. Hello. Derpy, you can catch wild Pokemon with Pokeballs. Follow me. Oh, okay, here it goes. Okay. I was like, something seems a bit off. And that's how you catch Pokeballs. <laughs> you guys get the gist of catching Pokemon, so I'll skip the sick me. Give me Pokeballs. Alright, you can try all kinds of things to see what works. I'll give you these. Good luck. Alright. And so the Nuzlocke challenge begins. Whew. First steps towards. Oh god. Okay, so this is the first Pokemon we have to catch in this route. If we don't catch this one, it's over. Of course! We saw some great Pokemon earlier, and now. I mean, I don't think he's all that bad. I think we could do something with him. So level 4. Will. Hmm. Will that kill him? Please don't. Please don't. Okay, thank you. you you're, you're tougher than that. I think I could go ahead. Is that. Is that full 50% right there? I don't want to risk it. I'm going to go ahead and throw a Pokeball at him. I had a thing that whenever I played this game, I would spam AB a lot in hopes of it helping me catch. Well, there's a Pokeball gone to waste. Oh, God. I really don't want to damage it because if I... Okay, there you go. There you go. It got, it got uh, weakened. Let's go ahead and try that again. I'm not sure if this is the Pokemon you wanted your name to be on, but it's the first one I've caught. <laughs> Toki. There you go. And no, for that second part, we're not gonna let you die. We're gonna have all of our Pokemon living together in happy harmony. No release of Pokemon on this section, or in this game. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'm gonna run out of power points for that. No poor peeps. Whoa! Hey! What's going on over here? Yo! You good, Tyranitar? Okay, yeah. I think he is. <laughs> I, I was there. I, I saw myself for a sec. Is the game bugging out because of the randomizer feature? Yikes. Okay. <laughs> um... <laughs> Alright guys, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a pause here. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, I'll try to get this fixed out, but I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks.